get too close to me in case you catch anything I genuinely I feel really really rough today but I'm gonna do a daily vlog I'm not gonna let me feeling crap get in the way of another brilliant vlog it might get in the way of a brilliant vlog and this might just be a vlog I'm running myself a nice hot bath I won't go into detail but I've had a bad stomach or not I've been up literally every hour on the hour so I've not slept Gemma's obviously got her own business, her own salon, so she's gone to work, so I'm on my own. It's just Hogan looking after me. He's not looking after me, he's... Have a look. That's him. There he is, looking after me. You right, mate? I need your help. Yeah. So it's me being a little bit rubbish being ill. I'm so bad at being ill. I left the bath on. This is a daily vlog following my life. Uh, it's sort of given me an opportunity to break it down a little bit because when the camera's not running, the stuff you don't see is really boring, but what I do, so, so things like contracts, booking forms. I don't just turn up to gigs and hope that they'll accept that I'm there. I have to book these gigs, do you know what I mean? So to have me sat there doing all those forms and phoning people and doing PR and posters and stuff would be really dull. I've never really shown me performing in, any, in these vlogs. You've seen little snippets of what I'm doing, but I didn't want to like, you know that, you know what I do. But I thought it gave me an opportunity because you lot have been great at replying, sending me stuff, sending me pictures. I thought it'd be great if there's something you want to see on here, then let's get you involved. I mean, this is my life, right? Also, I want you to see the things that you want to see. Do you know what I mean? I can only film what is my life. And that's why I thought, well, if I'm ill today, and I really felt crappy this morning after not sleeping, I thought, oh, I can't vlog today. But I, I am vlogging, and it's not the usual vlog where I'm out and about or I'm doing something, because I ain't going out, because I haven't slept, and I feel rough. So if there is something you want to see, this is the opportunity really to comment below the video once you've given it a thumbs up. I'd love to see this part of your life or someone said oh, I'd like to see more of Hogan. He doesn't really do a lot. But... Are you tired? You've done nothing, although you have followed me in every room to check I'm alright. So you get the idea, I read everything that you write, so I mean if you put something down I'll read it and if you want me to do something then maybe I'll do it. I think I need some more pills. This is an interesting vlog, isn't it? I need to get in that bath as well. Don't worry, I won't be filming that. Right, pills. Item and parcels coming in, so here comes Hogan. How come Gemma gets all the exciting and she's not here? Do I go out? I told you it was rubbish at looking after me. Just has me running around after him all the time. And then Robbie the cockatiel will just stop that. I think it might be a case that I just go to bed. Yeah, that includes you, Robbie. Just need to do some of that boring work I was t talking, ab talking about earlier. Peace. I've had a bath and I feel a lot fresher. I just want to say, and I bet you get this as well, you can't say you're ill because you know other people are a lot worse, right? But it's okay, you're allowed to not feel well and you're allowed to have a little moan about it. That's okay. One of the things that really winds me up is when people say, oh, oh, it's only a cold or it's only a stomach ache. What do they know about being ill? I'm sorry, but if you don't feel well, you don't feel well. And I'm not just saying that because I don't feel well today. It's a fact, yes. 
There are people in this world that are suffering a lot worse than me, but I don't feel very well, and that's okay. And if you don't feel well, that's okay. Don't feel bad about saying you don't feel well because there's someone worse off than you are. I just have the need to say that because I know for a fact that people will comment and probably moan about the fact that today I wasn't very well. But I love the fact that I'm getting the chance to actually talk to you. I love the fact that nothing special is going on today, but I'm getting the chance to speak. That is what's building this YouTube family. That was a bit, was a bit David Brown, wasn't it? So that's, I can't wait for that film to come out. Life on the road. It's the first film I'm actually booking tickets to go and see. I'm not even gigging, I've got the night off. So if anyone wants to book me on that day, oh, I'm not available. And it's not because I'll go, oh, sorry, I'm already booked. I will say, sorry, I can't. I'm going to the cinema. I'm having the night off. Anyway, Gemma will be home soon. Do you know what? I can't wait. And not just so she'll make me a cup of tea and stroke me head. She wouldn't stroke me head anyway. Look who's home. Oh my God. Um, what's going on? Think you've had enough? Look at the mess. Do you mind? I'm gonna go and get changed. That's all right, the world can see that. Chicken and mushroom slices for dinner. With salad, because I'm not very well. I'll cook it. Unbelievable. Happy to be home. Ecstatic. Are you going to look after me? Are you going to make me tease? Are you going to stroke my head? Enjoy your dinner I cooked. I love our chats. Right then. Right then. So. Today we get a new Prime Minister. I'd like to talk politics, but I don't know anything about politics. Most of all, it's been lovely having a chat with you and lovely that Gemma's come home and I've had a chat with her in depth. So I'm gonna go and feel sorry for myself by myself. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to tell me, like I said earlier, if there's something you want me to do, someone you want me to visit, leave a message below. You never know, I might well do it. Hopefully I'll feel a lot better tomorrow and that's when I'll see you. Have a chat? No. See you tomorrow.